Hello, Earth Signs. This is going to be August for you. I'm working on the Leo read right now. I don't know what's going on with Leo, and I swear to God, like, speaking personally, like, Zone's fucking with my Leo. I'm going to break their neck. I'm just letting you know, because I got feelings. We may not get along, but I'll be damned if someone's going to, like, fuck with him when I never got the chance to. That is mine. I get first tips. Anyway, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. This is for your sign in Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and you get a freebie, right? Right. Resonates with you. Cool. If not, just boop your nose where it goes, because I don't have the time. You got a pile out, as well as your cards laid out. Someone's anxious when it comes to sleeping. Or maybe they're just having trouble sleeping. I don't know. Um, it could be y'all, but I don't think it is. I think they're worried about someone coming with a cup of love, which is like, what? Like, who's offering what? It could be a water sign, right? But then they're like, no, I don't, I don't, I don't think I could do it, but they can't walk away. It's like that one cup just keeps them stuck where they are. And then there's just separation, maybe end of friendships. No one's having a good time at the party because a judgment call came in. Someone sh doesn't understand. Someone's feeling like, oh my God, and another person's just praying to St. Michael, being like, please. That's what's up with that book, and that came up before anything. Now, someone's working in Page of Pentacle energy, developing themselves, because their emotions are no longer clouding them. The clouds are disappearing. They're going past, so now there's just understanding, right? Now, someone is having trouble releasing energy, basically killing off this other one so they can get a new one in order to be happy. It feels like they don't want to do that. Over here, we got the fool. Someone's running away from a brand new start, and which would be punishment, I feel like. Or maybe they're scared this new start is punishment, like the fishies are at their feet and they're going, ouch, ouch, ouch. Maybe they're getting punished as they go. And someone, I, I'm not sure if someone sees that there's a lack of victory, that there's a lack of victory outside. Someone, like, I don't know if someone's being convinced that, like, wherever it is outside or there's no victory outside or some shit like that. I'm not sure, but it's like... It's like, like, I, I get a feeling that it's almost like someone's trying to convince you not to do something or signs. Or you're convincing yourself not to do that. Or maybe you're just having that one thought where it's just like, maybe I shouldn't do this because I'm, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm getting nervous. Like, I can completely understand that. Knight of Wands, Rivas. Someone's yelling things, but I'm not sure if um, it, it's accomplishing anything. They yell things, but they don't really take any action. I don't know, I have a situation like that with, like, I don't know. You ever, like, have someone in your life who you thought respected you, but then it's like, if you try to involve yourself in conversations where you know things and you've studied things, even though you didn't get where they are, you still are very familiar with it. But every time that, that, that you want a chance to be involved, it's like they cut you off, tell you you don't know what you're talking about, all this shit, it's just like... You know, I don't need the disrespect, and honestly, I almost want to punch in the face. You know, like, it's one of those where it's just like, you know, it, it, it's just the simple fact. And it's just like, you know, it's a person who doesn't even know how to listen to other people. And they'll gaslight and shit, and I just, I can't, I just cannot. It's like, like, the person I'm talking about, it's like they, their, their old behaviors are coming out, and honestly, it's just like, I haven't seen this in you in a really long time, and now all of a sudden it's back, and it's like, I don't think it, we're going to get along. You know, it's one of those where it's just like, ah, oh, it's better to just to keep a good, safe distance. Oh, God. It, it, they talk shit on you because they know they're not shit. It's one of them. It's one of them. It's one of them. Oh, is this what this is? This might not even be you doing this, then, Earth Signs. You might not be psyching yourself out. Someone might be trying to psych you out from doing something. Like, you know, oh, there's nothing out there for you. Don't do this uh, leap of faith. But you know that if you don't do it and you go running back, you're going to get punished for it. Your emotions are pretty clear. They're not clouded. You're not confused. I don't think you want to end something, though. Pharisees in the streets, weakling underneath. Pause button. 
Get some candle magic for clarification because there's too many veggies on the subway sandwich or signs. They have crickets as you walk by. They won't fucking talk to you though. I'm not cheating. I'm strained. Yeah, sure, whatever. But they most likely have sex with their boss and lose their job the next day. What the fuck? And they're brutally honest, or are they just brutal? Which I always have a problem with. Yeah. Oh, here's some. And oh, that's nice. That's nice. okay. Yeah, this is hmm. This individual. Oh yeah, well maybe that's what I was talking about then for. Y'all, this person will call you stupid before they actually admit you have a point, and that's an issue I have with my person earlier, because it was like, uh. But, I did go on a grand adventure. Me and my mom went to, like, my cousin's baby shower. She's having another little boy, and I was, like, all excited, and I was like, I really want to see him, and I was, like, really excited to see her, too, because I miss her. And it was just like, my mom was like, I don't even want to go. If you hadn't, like, requested off work, we probably wouldn't go, and I'm just like, oh, well... I mean, like, we don't have to go if you don't want to, but she's like, no, 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 we'll go, we'll go. So we'll go, we went up there, right? We drove, we were driving back, all of a sudden our car starts acting up. It's making the <laughs> noise, right? And it's just like, what the fuck? Their turbo hose, her turbo hose, the clamp came off and the hose was just barely hanging on. Uh, we actually ended up calling, like, some relatives that uh, lived up in the area where the, my uh, cousin had her baby shower because most of them lived up there. They managed to just go get a new clamp and fix it up and we were driving home and it was just like you know if i never requested off for the baby shower we didn't go up here eventually like you this would have been a bigger problem while you were home and you wouldn't have known what to done my mom was like i probably saved myself like hundreds of dollars <laughs> and i was like i know Mm, but yeah that was like an adventure for me so i accidentally saved my mom money by wanting to go to something like silly but it was actually really nice because i got to see a lot of family again a lot of them didn't even get a chance to see me for years and years and i'm so disconnected and it sucks but that was my fault for being that disconnected it was so nice to see some of them too. Like my aunt Cheryl, oh my God, bless her heart. That poor woman, she's gone through so much shit. My cousins, they've been taking care of her. Like my aunt, her friends. Like it was so nice to see a whole bunch of people I hadn't seen in so many years. Anyway, I'm gonna get back to the reading, my bad. But it, like, I guess I'm saying that to say like, you know, like maybe something crazy or trashy might come up. But maybe eventually it'll turn into a situation like I am, where it's just like, wow, if this hadn't happened, we would have been going through something way more different, or way off, or something like that. Or at least that's the silver lining I'm looking at. I don't know if y'all agree, but that's where I'm going. Alright, I'm done rambling about my life. Semi-square in Scorpio. Last quarter of with Pallas during the planetary retrograde, which is like in Saturn. <laughs> then there'll be a solar eclipse. Well, no shit, the moon. Oh, the moon and the sun. The solar, oh, you don't say. In Aquarius. Sun and moon both will be in Aquarius at some point. So I don't know if this will affect us coming up during the beginning of the month. Or not, so you guys are just gonna have to figure it out because I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Also, Earth. There you is. So. Got it. Thank you. Anyway, sat it on my book when my book was making it slide. So. Page Pentacle. The cap, Taurus, Virgo. This could be y'all. You might be taking the baby steps. Might be starting out as a baby, someone could have an earth sign child as well. Emotions are getting cleared up. You might be like starting to hone your own shit. You might be getting started on your destiny. Mmm. Someone doesn't want to play with somebody else. So someone's just gonna play by themselves. It's just like, okay, you turn your back on me. But you're coming back to talk that shit. 
you know, if this is you with this gray and, and whatever kitty, I don't know, it could be like two people on the other side, but like if this could be you, you're doing your own thing since this person won't. Like if you're not gonna join me in the play to mama, I'ma I'm a play, but they decided to turn their back. You're biting your time biting boxes before you grab your three pentacles. Cause yeah, like mm -hmm. What are you waiting for? And why is that making you hesitate? You're like, I don't want to wear my hat in the sun. It's kind of hot. Well, we know that, but you still have a hat on, so why are you hesitating? The door's closed. Mmm, art signs. This person's all the way in the back screaming, Let me in! And then it's, eh. It could be two people together, but it's like, mm. I think you're gonna have to close the door. Unfortunately, but whatever. You don't wanna close the door because it still makes you happy though. That kinda makes sense. Don't wanna end things. Uh, but you're a fat cat getting all your treats, all the pentacles. Ah, a couple books. This person's happy, could be a Leo, but for some reason you might have your guard up against them as you offer them a pentacle and be like, I am the emperor. I have the cone of power, right? Now the world seems like it's satisfied with each little teat and nipple you're showing, right? As you knock over your toy, you are definitely getting success with all of the treats that come out. However, when it comes to your emotions, you get your head stuck in the bucket. It's just like, the fuck? It's almost like this person could give you everything you could want and need except for emo emotional um, security or trust. You know, if they're talking that much shit about you, I don't think that you have a lot of confidence in them, Art Signs. It's like, kind of like with my person, it's like, I guess they feel as though, like, if they wanted to, they have the right to insult my intelligence. Which, like, for me, it's like, oh, okay. That's nice. I still got an hour. 11-11. Ha, that's funny. Uh, you know, I don't have to take that. Nobody has to take that. But it's just, I, I, I think it's like one of those things where it's just like you're trying to give someone the benefit of a doubt. They're like, good kitty, here's some treats. But it's just like, yeah, like the pentacles are nice. But don't be touching my treats. It's just, mmm. Like, how are you going to be a fat cat and they're insulting you for being fat when they keep giving you the treats to be fat on? Now, you kind of want to wiggle your butt a little bit during August and just be like, I want to chase this thing. It's coming from a different direction, though. It's coming from the present. Not from this direction and not even from yourself, from the present. Which could lead you to this forest area, but I still feel like someone doesn't want you going in the, out the fuck side. You're not sure what to do. I think you're being led somewhere else, Art Signs. People might be talking about that, too. Oh, I had another other book here, too. Someone wants to act like a magician, but apparently they wasted all their valuable time. I'm trying to get you... I don't know. Did you have your claws out for a minute, Art Signs? Because it seems... I don't know if it was you or them, but obviously it made you feel a bit ostracized. No, like if everybody was just playing games and shit with each other, or this game, or even the communication would have been shitty, but they all look like just pissed off cats, but this one especially, and I'm taking that one as your side, and it's just like, did you do something? Like, are you having mental exercises with people? Now, one, now it looks like you're older than the other person, right? But this person thinks that they're smart because they're good at solving puzzles. But apparently they got some seers that are causing their dogs to bark that are making you realize that they'll book it before they actually, like, share something with you. Like, look at the difference. This card, for me, Five of Pentacles first, I usually take it as this cat taking all the treats and running when it's supposed to be you both share it together. I don't know what this partnership is for you. It could be a fire sign. Sure. But, um... They don't seem to care very much about you, Earth Signs. I don't even think that they they give a shit about like how they make you feel either. 
you know, because if they really, really, really gave a shit about you, I feel like they should be listening rather than just talking shit, because that's easy. No, they just want to escape this death situation. Maybe you want to escape a death situation. Or maybe you don't know what to do, because it seems like, once again, death is reversed. This person might feel like they like they want to crush you, but they really don't want to because they still have feelings for you and shit. But the problem is, is the way that they're uh, running away from the situation. That's the real issue. Like they like they can run their mouth, but they can't fucking apologize for being rude. Mm. See, I wasn't. Even, and then I, I laid this out thinking about like Teletubbies and how creepy they were because I just watched. I actually watched the video of Orcas. I found that they're like surplus hunters and killers, which means that like they kill for food, but they also kill for fun and for training and other purposes, which means that like they're la they're basically humans with fins and less compassion. Like they'll beat the fuck out of a Did you know that they go after seals? Like they'll chuck a they'll knock a seal 15 feet in the air, toss it around, all that shit. Seals are absolutely terrified of orca cuz orcas are just mean. Have you ever seen an orca go after a trainer? You know how serious that is? They will whip your ass anyway. Now, not taking a leap of faith here could be punishment. Persons on the couch, Queen of Swords, could be Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I think that they think that they're smart, logical. They could be. I'm not saying that they're not, but it's like. It's like they'd rather go to war than actually use their brain and relax. And, and like, you know, I don't know. Like, for me, it, it's just like, I don't want to get emotional if I'm having an argument with somebody. But it's really annoying that people do. Because then it's like, I don't know. But I feel like this person needs to chill and think for a minute. Because someone's head stuck in the bucket of emotion. And they may be coming around because they're, you know... Being impatient, they feel very impatient. They feel like I'm gonna knock this whole bowl over and then lap up the water, right? Earth signs, you might be feeling like you're too busy b bothering with the pentacles to realize you only play with the pentacles because you need the treats. You know, you do have a successful world right here. You do have your shit set up, but you don't feel any sort of victory. You were distracted because, like this person over yonder, they're just happy where they are in their little sunflower seat. This is the person who go out of the way and insult you and then feel better about it themselves. That's like pretty much like they just, they they'll feel better every time they insult you. I think that's what the problem is, Earth signs. It's like, what did I say before? You're gonna blow it off anyway. Is that what I said before? I don't even remember the entirety of that, but I just remember that. Um, at some point, you're gonna just be like, I don't wanna. I don't think you're to the point where I don't want it anymore. But now it's like I really don't wanna. Am I supposed to at this point? Because it doesn't feel like much of a reward to me. Actually, it feels like more of a waste of your time, I think. This full reverse of the punishment. This person's intuition just is not working. It's not working. It's not working. Uh, it, like they're taking, it, they don't understand why you all are, are clashing. And that's the weird thing, because they're the ones with their mouth open, or signs. They gotta have the fireplace with somewhere, because because they must not be thinking before they speak. They gotta have Aries somewhere. But I don't understand why this person is lacking intuition when it comes to this conflict. Because it should be two kittens playing with toys, but instead I feel like this is a little bit more intense than that. Like, one cat scratch, scratch the other, and now they're actually biting the fuck out of each other to doing bunny kicks. There's a lack of balance here. They might be saying this about y'all. <laughs> Honestly. But this is, like, them talking shit, too. Mm. They don't know what they're talking about, and, and that's why you retracted your clause. I don't think that's. I, I, I don't think that's it. Like, especially if you got twelfth house placements, like I do. If you got twelfth house placements, 
One thing you learn over time is that it's better just not to tell people exactly what they need to know. It, some things are just better left unsaid because people aren't going to fucking listen to it anyway nor give you the time of day. You know, at least that's what the Teletubbies in my head when I was freaked out about. Like, did you? I don't know. I, I, I'm not going to get over that because it was some freaky shit that I saw with Teletubbies and that's the only reason why I did it. it like, I was watching like one of those um, YouTube short things because fuck... TikTok, I ain't supporting that shit. Um, it's terrible. <laughs> like the lip flag people get insulted, and then people still go out there just to watch the stitch shit. It's just like, how are you gonna allow this market to keep going? No, I'm not. I'm not. No, fuck TikTok. Fuck TikTok. Now shorts, I can do. I like YouTube shorts because at least YouTube is strictly dickish to everybody, and I can appreciate that. At least I'm used to YouTube. TikTok, they'll just ruin my shit if I complain about being so black. I feel, I, I, I like, you know, I, I don't feel like that that app was invented with the best intentions as much as it is a spell that's exploiting everybody with what they believe. Well, I'm not even sure how the exploitation works. I just know it drives people crazy. It drives people crazy and it makes them forget who the fuck they are. That's the one thing I, I've realized about TikTok. People who continually get on there and especially they start looking for particular stuff, they forget who exactly they fucking are. People want to do jump cuts where it doesn't sound like they're breathing anymore, and it's just like, what the fuck? You know, people need a break for the brain. It's too much information. You know, we used to complain about that in school. Like, you're giving us too much shit to learn at once, but I can remember, like, four fucking videos sometimes if I'm really concentrating hard enough. But that's beside the point. What is this lack of victory in going outside in the yard? They're not baiting you with that. Huh. But look, I made a crescent. No, you, you, no. Someone isn't getting distracted by something. Either it's behind them. Someone isn't getting distracted by their past because they got like their little treats here. And they're being very careful with just, I'm just going to touch the water. I'm not going to get all the way in. I remember last time. Someone's just leaving. It doesn't matter how someone feels. They're still leaving shit behind. The past isn't about to drag you back. You don't even see it anymore. You're becoming brand new. I'm an empress. Okay, I'm just resting and shit. Could be you, Taurus. Ooh, the tower. Mm. See, that makes me curious. Ew. Rank you, motherfucker? Like, look, like this person's overburdened with the ten of toys or wands, and that causes a lover separation, possibly with a Gemini. But I think it's weird that there's a tower after an Empress and a Queen of Wands pop up. Like, this is the woman everybody wants, but this is the bitch everybody like wishes they could get with. And there's a tower between them, Earth sign. Someone, they, someone like mad because you. Is someone mad because you're prettier than them or some shit? Like, what the fuck is that? What? Why are there bitches arguing with each other? In what way? That's fucking weird. Oh, they're trying to bait you. For sure. It's just like, no, you're staying in your Empress energy. Third signs. And this person's like, well, let me sleep on it. But that's the tower. Then that's what cuts it off. Because it cuts it off. What cuts it off. Because it's just like they left it I think they left it alone. They, out, they played out their shit. And now there's a complete separation. Oh, great water. Rich gent. Could be you. Makes sense. This person might have sorrow. Fatality. What the fuck? Of a main character? Someone wins slots, but they don't feel like it's a gift. Hmm. Now, Earth signs? I'm not saying too much. I'm not saying much of anything at all, right? Because it's just like, my fucking business. It's your shit. 
but I feel as though... I don't know what... The best way I can put this... So even my feelings are in this a little bit, just looking at this, it's just like, oh, okay, so this is what the fuck is happening, huh? That, that's the path we're taking. Earth signs, whether you're in the right or the wrong, doesn't matter. What matters is, is, um, well, someone could really sit here and doubt you. Because it's like you've already blown off something about them before. And if you're blowing somebody off, I mean, you could be dealing with another earth sign, too, who's blowing you off, and you're just like, oh my fucking god. See, this is why nobody wants to put up with you. That's what you want to say to them, but you can't. And I don't think that you want to. And I think that's the problem, is, like, you're not actually voicing what the fuck is wrong with this person. Like, but they're talking shit on you, and it's just like, why aren't you defending earth signs? Why aren't you defending yourself against this person properly? If they're attacking you, there's a reason why you're not doing much back and I think it's because you care about them and that's the problem however the problem is is that um this sorrow this fatality this main character all this weird shit they don't really care about you but eventually they're going to need you and that's the messed up part like, you know, it's like a teenager who takes their parents for granted, or better yet, like, Max in the Goofy movie, right? When he looks at his dad and he's just like, I'm an adult now, I have my own life. And his father looks at him and he's just like, I know that, I just want to be part of it. It, it makes sense when you're a kid from Max's perspective, but once you're an adult and you have kids, that scene made me ball like a motherfucker because I felt that. You know, Goofy is Goofy because it's a coping mechanism for him. He, he lost his wife. He, he, he was in a miserable place. He had a terrible job and his son seemed like he hated him and he was about to go away. You know, he just wanted to relive one last memory and, well... It didn't really come into it until, like, his son actually did something that his father taught him that he was so proud about. Brought him back together. But in between that time, it was, like, no gratitude, no understanding, no grasping of, um, you're hurting the person that cares about you, you know? And I'm not saying that, like, if, if, if there's a necessary need to cut someone off or whatever. I'm, like, I'm not going to argue with you against that. Your situations are all different. They all match whatever. But earth signs, um, whoever you're dealing with, just leave them the fuck alone. And I'm not even kidding. Either they learn or they don't. But if they don't, that is no longer your concern because you if you're not even willing to defend yourself against someone you care about because you're scared of hurting them, because that's what that really feels like to me. Which is like, what are you scared of? Like, just tell them off like you do it to everybody else. But I kind of understand too. But if you're too worried about doing that, just let them go. If they, I mean, if they were really concerned, they would come around. But if they decided, like, you know, you're more of an obstacle than you are someone they want to deal with, then, you know, it's like... Well, like, why do you want to deal with someone who... who only does this? Huh? Do you want someone around who you can't even trust to have your back? I don't think so. That's your reading for the beginning of August, Earth Signs. Please try to take care and... You know, even if you wish you could get along with someone, chances are you wanted to get along with them, but they weren't thinking of that. It was, it's more like, um, I'll get along with you as long as you um, act, think, behave a certain way. 
And believe me, I know, sometimes it's a lot easier just to be by yourself than it is to try to, uh, assimilate with others. Anyway, love you. Be safe. Stay suspicious. Bye-bye.